Morning YouTubers, hope everybody is well. We're just having a little stretchy wetchy here, aren't we, Patty Wacky? Actually, I was having a stretch and you just invaded my space and just joined it. Look, I'll let you stay. This is my block. Get off it. Go stretch over there. Right, hope everyone's good. It is a Tuesday here in the lovely UK. Stoke on trend, just in case anyone knows. Uh, it's International Chess Day. Sorry, Monday's International Chess Day, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, it's international no day right now because uh, all gyms are shut in the UK right now uh, until probably March, we think. I mean, it's the first week in January, so uh, it's very dire here for the UK, I must be honest. There's a lot of, a lot of miffed off people. Today is chest day for us, so we're going to do dumbbells today as well. Okay. We're going to do dumbbells today then. We alternate, we do a week of bench, a week of dumbbells, just so you alternate the two, and we find that one works slightly different muscles. The dumbbells do tend to transfer over to boxing a little bit better, because obviously we can do the one arm motion, um, but they are a hell of a lot harder, because obviously it's to stabilize, stabilize the muscles in all the upper body that we're, we're being used. So uh, we'll do a little bit of warming up, a bit of stretching, and then we'll get on the dumbbells and see how heavy we can go. Yeah. Maybe up to 80 kilo. shoulder injuries for the best part of the month but slowly crept back up so I'm quite happy with that just done the 80s feeling pretty good uh, quick protein shake the whey isolate from my protein is absolutely amazingly good two scoops of this 50 gram of protein which is perfect sort of an hour into the training session keeps me going up until lunch um, it's probably one of the best products on the, on the My Protein site. The other one is the Whey and the Whey Plus. Um, but I do cycle them. I'll do like a month on the Whey, a month on the Whey Isolate, I'll do a month on the Whey Plus. Just to keep variety, it's important to keep variety in your supplements because if you get, let's say you had a chocolate brownie flavored protein shake for four years, solid in a row, you're gonna not start enjoying that product. So my advice, with protein and supplements is to cycle it. Different flavors, slightly different variants. Uh, keep things exciting, you know. I think that variety is man's best friend in life. That's what I always say. <laughs> it's 
splendid. Right up next, so we've done, I always say I like to do the, like, the sort of main exercise of the session, which is done. You know, the, the incline dumbbells went up to an 80 kilo weight, which is good. Um, that'll have done most of the damage. Now, it's just about getting these, like the, the different fibers in the chest. So flies will hit slightly different fiber. Um, and basically for, the, for what I'm training for with the boxing, flies are really gonna increase that hook power. So it's there out there, that's when you get that hook power in. So doing flies is essential for sort of building up that explosive power in the boxing. And then we'll probably do um, cable punches as well. So with a cable in the boxing stance, punch as hard and as far as you can, try and get the cable to sort of relax for a second in the, in the end result. Um, so we'll do three sets on cables, three sets on punches, and then we'll do sub scap and triceps. And again, everything is super, like as heavy as we can go, as explosive as we can go. Um, I mean, yes, I'm training for boxing, but it's quite exciting for me to see what I can do physique wise, because these are actually exercises that make you look a little bit soft because you're just explosive power. You're not really getting much volume in there, but I feel like it's starting to give me a little bit of shape, uh, especially around here. Stack. It's important when I'm doing these for my goal is to keep the boxing stance and try and uh, replicate what I do, even the footwork. Two more sets on that and then we'll get going on the sub scap and the triceps. Last bit on the session now, so we'll do sub scap. So fast up, control it down, 10 on each arm or 12 on each arm. And then um, we'll do the push triceps, so basically from behind the edge of the ropes. Do as heavy as you can basically for three sets of 10 to 12 reps. And that's plenty, you know, done enough activation with the triceps with the, all the chest work that we've been doing, especially the dumbbells. So it's just a nice little finish here for the triceps, so we'll, uh, we'll crack on. Oh, 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 oh. oh, I think 
nothing's more the, more the point. I'm absolutely soaking. It's <laughs> yeah, it's like freezing the sweat on me. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh god. Look at that frosty, frosty feet. Frosty, frosty nipples. Frosty everything. Right, that's a wrap for this morning's session. So this morning we did, what do we do? 1.3 mile yeah. um, run, breakfast. We've just done a two hour chest session. Um, and then we'll have just done the cryotherapy. So I'm absolutely freezing now. Um, that's a good idea. So yeah, I'm absolutely freezing now. And then I'll have my dinner get my slippers on, get in bed, um, a little nap and then boxing tonight at four o'clock for, for a good hour. I usually do, well, I'm doing eight three minute rounds every single session now, sometimes more, sometimes 10. Um, so yeah, just letting you guys know that I'm still on the ball. You know, if I'm ever quiet on social media or YouTube, don't worry, like things are still full ball my end. So uh, uh, everything is on track. Hope you enjoyed the video guys, um, don't forget to like it, subscribe to the channel, anything you want to see hit me up in the comments, but stay safe out there, big love the beast, take care.